We made it, Chatter. Ils sont loin d'être ridicules au LEC. Invité de dernière minute. Venu tout droit d'Espagne. Heavy Brusor, VTO, Flakhead, Flakhead, and someone else. VTO looking cute. Whoa, the Heretic jersey is kind of, kind of fucking cool. I like that. Is that their academy support? Oh, here they come, the league boys. Here they come. Jamin Cop! On commence avec le bouclier de l'équipe! Oh yeah! Tant qu'il est debout, il a rien qui passe! Le capitaine, mais surtout le top liner! Capo! Oh, look at that crowd! Oh, King Cabo, baby! Captain Cabo! Captain Cabo! And now it's time for Commander Syncroft! Oh, look at the flag! Captain Cabo, Commander Sinkrov. Now here comes Sergeant Second. Le génie, l'illusionniste. Faites place pour votre midliner. Bro, Syncroft can't even move. Now it's time for Conqueror Callista. Bro, they can't even move. Le prochain, rassurant, mais aussi très percutant. Un monstre au visage d'ange. Mesdames et messieurs, Oh, they do Targamas before Kalista. They do the tank Targamas before Kalista. Kalista last. Oh, Sakin can't move. Oh, here he comes. Uh, the best AD carry in ERL. The highest ELO. The most talented, biggest prodigy. This guy is going to be... Superstar in two years. This guy will be a superstar in two years, 100%. I mean, he already is, but he'll be an international superstar. He's so fucking good. This guy is insane. I haven't followed much K Corp apart from EU Masters, but I followed this kid. This kid is crazy good. Rank one and rank two. The bad thing for Kalist is uh, he just turned 17, but LEC just the increased the rule. Finally over. LEC just increased the rule to 18 instead of 17. Here comes the announcement. I know the announcement already. So T1 is coming to Berlin in December, and a lot of uh, European teams will be playing against them. I will be there as well. It's not locked, but I think I'll be there as well. Uh, it'll be Faker, T1 versus K Corp versus. Yeah, everyone. It's gonna be crazy. That's gonna be crazy. Uh, it's crazy to K Corp versus T1. That's crazy. Sakin versus Faker. I think a lot of people will be excited for that. It'll be fun to watch. It'll be fun to watch. I don't know what's. You know, I don't know if. I think T1 will do pretty damn good against them, but, you know, maybe maybe K Corp can take a game. But you have to understand that, like, you know, T1 destroys G2, and G2 is, you know, so I think K Corp is gonna get destroyed. But it'll be fun. What the fuck? Bro, K Corp fans are psychotic. What the hell? Uh, K Corp's fan base, fan base is unmatched, man. They're like football fans, man. What other team can sell out 30,000 seats, make a show match in every game, have flags everywhere? I don't know, they're crazy. I meant like ERL team, is what I kind of meant. Yeah, Koi does it easy. Yeah, I guess Koi is the same. Koi and K Corp. I want more Koi versus K Corp. I want more Ibai versus Kameto. That's hype as fuck. It's not often you get to see Koi versus K Corp. They did one show match, which was really fun to watch. Holy shit. 
shit. Elle continue! Elle continue! Elle continue! D'ailleurs, grand merci à Tim Eric. Oh, they're screaming at the blue wall. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> look at them. Imagine playing against them on stage. Playing against them on stage must be so annoying, bro. It's absolute library when you do something really nice. And if they get a kill, you can't even hear your team. Oh my god. What the hell? Yeah, Ebi, Ebi Donc, came from ça, Japan just for this game, I think. So respect for Ebi. What is that guy doing? He's running. Oh, what's going on here? What the fuck? Those who don't jump are not Carmine. You're not allowed to be part of Carmine if you don't jump. Fuck it! Am I joining? Is that okay? That's just classic casual stream. No, I can't jump more. My neighbors will come and kill me. They're stalling for content. Bro, that, she's like... Bro, fucking grandma in there, dude. She's loving life. Holy shit. She's... Bro, she's fucking enjoying it. Syncroff. Bro, they're like in the middle of the, of the arena. Kalista. With the fucking... The fucking beast, Kalista. Wait, can they see the screen? Yo, 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 they can look to the left and see the minimap. Yo, Riot. Hey, that's not fair. Wait, they can ghost. Sort that out. Bro, they're going crazy. Holy shit, everyone's running over. They're, it's like football, bro. Like, what's going on? Oh, everyone's going down. Oh, they're going to do the what's the color. Oh, no, no, yet. Bro, cameraman is stuck. Yo, ca where's cameraman? Cameraman is fucking gone. <laughs> the One Piece dude's just chilling. Luffy is just chilling, bro. Was it what is your what is your profession? Holy fuck. <laughs> well, we're in game. What do we got? Wow, Heretic's comp is really weird. I need, they need AP Kaiser. Need AP Kaiser. So the Jace is Vitio. Jace is Vitio. Targum is roaming middle, really? Oh, he's not in vision either. He might have walked into vision there for a second. I'm not sure if he did, though. Should know something's up, though. He's playing really safe. Goodbye, Vitio. He doesn't have phase rush on Jace, so he can't really afford to walk up. He doesn't die. He gets lucky. Maybe he does, actually. He spent on the flash situation. Kalist has to give up a little bit, but the wave's pushing into him, so it's fine. I don't know. Casey's draft is really strong in mid-game, especially if there's just like a lot of random skirmish fights going on. But uh, Heretics needs a slow fight. Though. Heretics needs really slow fights. They have Jace Alistar, which is really good, but... Um, uh, Alistar Sejuani, which is really good. They have Jace Kaisa. Need to be slow. Yeah, what patch are they on? 13-7. Yeah, Riot's ruling is that you can't have five NEC players in a show match. I think you can only have three. We had the same thing in 2020 when we did a show match against Misfits. So, um, the three NEC players from Heretics are Ebi, Flakhead. It's not a bad rule, but uh, yeah. So, Yankos isn't playing. And uh, Mercer has been playing live. Yeah, this is live. I wonder what happens at the Red Bull event then in December with with T1 and, and Heretics and stuff like that. Are they allowed to use their starting players? They should be. Oh, what a hook from Targa! Holy shit! Wow, they've got every item they buy on the right side. Hmm. They have really good mid to bot setup here, K Corp. On surveille le all-in sur Flakhead. Flakhead, attention, le plus belle, il va connecter le hook de Targamas aussi. Flakhead, il a encore un flash à disposition. Nerves of steel from Flakhead, holy shit. Nerves of steel. Il a déjà fait son bac. Génération d'HP, régénération de mana. Et attention, parce qu'Heretics veut peut-être se battre. That's crowd is nuts. That was close. That was close. A bit too close, maybe. Top is winning in isolation. Everything else is pretty even. They can stack away bot here, K-Corp, and play for Herald. Heretics' jerseys are kind of cool. 
sur ce top side. Ah, uh, Ça peut donner Maybe they can kill. Attention La barre est chargée. La barre est chargée. Attention, ça arrive là directement sur Camo. Ça va être un peu compliqué. Il arrive à sortir de là. Il envoie l'ultimate. Oh, nice, il nice. essaye de turn. Il essaye de mettre ses dégâts. Il sait qu'il est peut-être un peu cuit. Il essaye de sortir de là. Mais trop de dégâts oh, en face pour Clutch. Nice trop compliqué pour Camo ici. Trop de dégâts. First the whole crowd goes silent. The whole crowd was like, oh. Et donc, je pouvais pas vraiment faire beaucoup plus dans sa situation. Superbe réaction de la part de Kalis ici. Est-ce qu'on peut aller chercher plus sur ce combo Il a claqué son ulti et derrière Marlon était content. It's Kalist baby. Très, très bon. This guy will just carry. But Flak is also going Kraken I think. Thank God. KC got, uh, got Herald. Where is Vitio? Vitio is Jace. He just has a weird name. The guys don't start a war in chat. Nothing is wrong with the crowd. This is a K-Corp event. It's all K-Corp fans. Of course they're gonna be hyped for K-Corp. It's, it's not a neutral ground. It's, it's K-Corp's K -Corp's event, K-Corp arena, K-Corp fans. Of course they're gonna scream for K-Corp. There's no Heretics fans in the crowd at all. There's not a single. If it was in Spain, it would be a lot different, right? But it's not. Oh, he missed Q. Oh, he hit Q. What the? Oh, Targamash with the hooker. Kalis flash. Oh, Targa, that was clean. Oh my god, it's a montage in the bot lane. Targa. Oh, he didn't get the time. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, he almost had the timer there. Perfect, Targa. So close. Oh, Ebi. Ebi, 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 Ebi. Ebi! Holy Ebi. Alistar W'd into Zach Otherwise, this fight was dead. What a hook. Oh, he tried to E flash on the Flacket there as well. That was cheeky. Oh, if he got this reset here, it would be instant triple kill. Kalis clean. Yeah, Flacket's doing his best. They loop straight here. Croissance! He said croissance! Oh, croissance is the scale. Oh, fuck. I thought he said croissance. What the hell? Ebi winning top, uh, mid is just a farm fest, both mid is just farming. Oh, get him Ebi! Oh. I don't know if Ebi wants that. Oh, Tsingrov! No flash! He's dead. Ebi's carrying! Ebi's carrying! And everyone's silent. You don't give Ebi Cassante. If you watch the LEC, at all this year, you don't give Ebi Kassante. Mid lane is just trovying. Meteo 170 CS at 15. They're getting Herald. Well, this, ma this map state for Heretics is garbage. They're losing Herald and top tier one. And Renekton is free farming bot. Man, jungle support of Heretics is running around lost as fuck. They have no idea what they're doing. They're so late to bot. Why was he even taking blue? The problem is, like, all of Heretics macro comes from Yankos Mursa, probably. Or at least Yankos. But without Yankos Mursa, this team has like a good carry and good solo lanes. That's it. They have no map play, they have no calls, they have no leader, they have no team fights, they have nothing. So they're gonna be really slow. Man, if they, I think they lost the two most important roles, to be honest. As long as laners can go even and carry can just clean up, then jungle support is everything. Oh, nice play there. Good punish. He's chasing Kalist. Look at Kalist auto spacing. He's just fucking with them. Oh, he should have stayed in hammer form. Hammer form gives a lot of armor. He should have stayed in hammer. He should... Wait, Saken solo killed Ebi? How? What happened to Ebi? He just went in and died. Oh, he's trying to... 
Ah, Ebi, where are you going, bro? Holy fuck. Oh, he got Zaya flash. Nice try. Right. Commence, let him commence. Or no, not commence. Koison. Holy fuck, three drakes. Man, heretics aren't contesting any objectives. Uh, need to start fighting heretics, need to start fighting for vision uh, in, uh, in river ASAP. Uh, this rise is getting so strong. Like two more minutes and this rise is going to be absolutely feeded as fuck. It's going to be like level 15 at 22 minutes. 23 minutes. Oh, Ebi's caught me. Where the fuck did that Johnny was go? Oh, it's a horror fight for heretics. Why the fuck is he engaging? Jace was pulled with no TP. Man, I feel so bad for the like Blurzor and Marlon playing on this side stage. They must be like feeling kind of. I hope they don't feel too much pressure. Hope they're chilling. It's not often you play in front of 30,000 people, let alone 30,000 people who are hoping you lose the whole game and don't even say a word when you get a kill. Like, I know it's a friendly match, but the World Championship, I think. The, in San Francisco was 23,000 30,000 people holy fuck like Montpellier was big but I think that was like 12 that's a lot of people oh Syncroft breathing or is he oh Vizio got hit oh GG that's nice. But Syncroft has no smite, maybe. Syncroft has no smite. He's probably saying he has no smite. Still no smite. Oh, the turn is so good. Doesn't matter. Kalista, thanks. Clean. Very clean. Yeah, Heretics without Yankos is a, tr is a struggle. They need Yankos. Not that Blorosaur is doing anything, like, egregiously wrong, you know? I'm sure, like, he's a good player, but Yankos is just another beast, you know? He's one of the best in the world. Mm. Yeah, Vizio hasn't really been in the game. Vizio has not done anything. There's nothing he can do. It's a stomp, man. I mean, look at Kalista. He's 3.4k gold up. The soul. The dragon soon. <laughs> Look at all the fire behind them. VTO's laughing. I wonder what their screens are like with that much fire behind them. I feel like there's probably a lot of glare on the screen. You can't see shit. You know when the sun's on it? I feel like that's exactly what happens there. It just melted. Yeah, VTO has changed name. Yeah, he's not called VTO anymore. He's called Generic 5. So next year, when he's playing for Heretics, um, he's going to be called Generic 5. Big hooker. No, it's not real. I'm trolling. It's a random account. He probably didn't have his PR account. Oh, it's over. It, oh, they're not ending. I think they could maybe end or push for a tower. Oh, the fire's going on top. So that's fire behind them. I've seen the players go like this. Look at Syncroft. The fire is landing on top of him. And it's burning their arms. I've seen a few players do that already. <laughs> When, <laughs> when the fireworks comes out, uh, yeah, it's the infernal soul. It's immersive. 
It's immersive. I saw Marlon doing it as well in the early game. La Carmine qui avance en unité. Attention, un fight qui se déclenche à nouveau. Mais la interception de la part de Blurz. Mais Marlon va tomber une nouvelle fois. Targamas, quelle frénésie dans cette game. Et peut-être le punch final, Mike. Clairement, il n'y a plus grand chose. C'est du 5v3 ici. Ça y va, si Grand Viva, il va toucher un suspect. Il va rater. Fetéo qui va se faire souffler. Et il enchaîne avec son ulti pour un deuxième kill. 15k gold lead, 26 minutes. Easy win. That was a stomp. That was a stomp. Are you kidding? Yeah, Sinkroff's getting all the fire on him again. Well, that's it. It's only best of one. It was only a best of one show match. What? Are they going to the LEC? Next year? Holy fuck. Answers in October. Oh, this is so, so hot. Oh, Kameto. He did it! His mom's here. Mesdames et messieurs, on a vibré ce soir, on a vécu au rythme de l'e-sport, on a essayé de vous partager un morceau de notre univers, on espère l'avoir bien fait. Quand j'entends tout ce que j'ai entendu ce soir, j'ai envie de vous dire qu'une chose, c'est que tout ça, c'est que le début. Mais maintenant, mesdames et messieurs, ça va être à vous d'écrire et de compter la suite. Merci pour tout. Gabi Oh. They're making it to LEC. It's a long time coming. They deserve it. They deserve it. What more do you want? They kind of deserve it, right? They're so fucking big. Like, how many viewers does this have? 120k? It probably had more. I know that sometimes K Corp fans are toxic, and uh, I think there's definitely some people who take it a bit too far. But I think ov overall, K Corp is uh, K Corp is on another level. Like they just are. They are just on another level. There's no European team that is as big as K Corp that's not in the LEC right now. It's about time for. K K Corp to get in there to be honest. See what they can do. It LEC would benefit. LEC would benefit so much from having K Corp in there.